What's up everyone, Jeremy here from MTG Headquarters and we've got a Just The Sauce video. In case you don't know what a Just The Sauce video is, I rip the pack, we look at the rare and I move on to the next. It's a quicker video, but uh, you get the, uh, the essence of the cards. I don't read through every rare. A lot of people just, a lot of people really like this format of video. So I always try to make sure I can do at least one with every new set. Hope you guys are having fun. I hope a lot of you have entered to win your free Dragons of Tarkir booster box shipped anywhere in the world. Whoops, bumped the camera there, sorry. Uh, make sure you check out my $5 challenge video. And uh, consider checking out Game Finder. I think a lot of you will be new to the channel, but it's an app I'm currently, that has just a few days left on the Kickstarter. And uh, we're basically you can Enter in whatever kind of game you want to play, whether it's Magic or a board game or Warhammer or Hero Clicks, and then find people within a certain mile radius who want to play the same game. It's a great way to meet people. We've got awesome stretch goals, and uh, once we uh, hit funding, we can add a feedback system so you can rate your experience with other players and kind of like eBay, so everyone will know if somebody's a jerk or know if somebody's cool. Avatar of the Resolute, very good first rare. I think that card could be Spice Incarnate. Spice Incarnate. Yes, that's what I said, Bunny Bread. Double green, 3-2, reach trample. Some uh, token stuff, goodies also. Somebody will, somebody will make that card pretty good. Ooh, Sidisi, Undead, Vizier. Five mana, four, six, Death Touch, Exploit. Very, very good. I gotta get my groove. I'm, I'm going too slow for a sauce video. Sorry. I haven't done one in a little while. I'm sure a lot of you are like, yeah, you haven't, you jerk. You jerk. Stop working on your stupid app. JK. <laughs> Echoes of the Kid Tree. Uh, Dragon Lord Jarmoka. Very spicy. Ooh, and uh, another foil. Colgon Storm Singer. Definitely have, haven't like hit a crazy box yet, but I've only opened one. So, I mean, you know. Volcanic Vision. Meh. Meh. How's your guys' Dragons of Tarkir weekend going? I know a lot of you asked me to do more boxes this time. I'm going to try to do more in the first week. Um, we'll see if I can get some prizes or something at, at FNM and get some store credit. I'll bring some cards and trade them in so I get some more for you. Pristine Skywise. Pretty Dragon. Hidden Dragon Slayer, okay. So what are the what are the sleeper cards of the set, do you think? I'm not sure what, what's gonna be crazy yet or not. But I am brewing for the first time in a long time. Dragon Lord's prerogative is very good and limited. I don't know if it's he's playing anywhere else, but every game I cast that, I won. I don't know if that's a chicken or an egg thing, but it's pretty good to draw a bunch of cards. Generally a solid blue mode. Faux Razor Regent. I haven't really seen any of the, uh, well, the Avatar was good in all my boxes. I mean, I've opened one of the Planeswalkers. Haven of the Spirit Dragon. I actually played this at pre-release because I had a bunch of dragons in my deck. And being in two colors, it didn't really matter that I kind of had a extra random land. Blood Chin Fanatic. This is a card I'm experimenting with in my mono black deck. Definitely could fit. Gonna rock a play set of those and see how the deck runs. Still waiting for it to get released on MTGO, be another week. So, 
Maybe I can build something in real life here in the meantime. I've got my most of my mono black deck done. Blood Chin Rager and a Berserker's Onslaught. You're going to be doing a video next week on uh, trading with me. Because so many people are asking and I really wasn't... Really wasn't worth my time to be selling everything on TCG Player, so I'm gonna do something a little different now. I'll inform you guys about that next week. Swift Warkite. All right. Oh yeah, there we go. Sarkhan Unbroken. Wake me right up. Nice. Nice. We're early too. We got quite a few packs left. That's an early Sarkhan. Let's get right to foil planes. Another back-to-back -back mythics. Ojitai exemplars. Very good. Okay. Could we... Could we be in the Saz? Are we in the Saz? Another foil. Crater Elemental. Am I reading that card wrong? Like, is it better than I think? Kraken Dem packs just for you. Blessed reincarnation. I'm also going to try to open a box on stream tonight. Well, that'll be past tense. But I don't know. I might need to save it so I can do some videos next week. Deathbringer Regent. That is a BAD dragon. BAD. I mean. Secure the Wastes. Seems like uh, that was kind of like the crap job they gave the guys in the military. Crap job. See what I did there? Ha! I'm genius. Radiant Purge. So have you guys drafted dragons yet? Maybe you're... Going to your first draft today. Living lore. I don't know what to think of draft yet. I really haven't strategized about it. I mean, there is such a big swing in power level and cards of Fate Reforge that, like, I'm not sure what to expect. Oh, we have a foil rare, though. Sidisi. Undead Vizier. And then Asher and Sovereign. Like, you know what I mean about, like, okay, Citadel Siege is just so much better than anything else. And, like, then you have a lot of junk rares. Foul Renewal. So it's kind of hard to, like, I don't know how the draft is going to... I guess it's going to just mostly be dragons, right? Like, you're going to run a lot like the pre-release... So that's probably safe to safe to say. A Stratus Dancer. Megamorph. Go go Megamorphin. Megamorphin. Dutiful Attendant. And a profound journey. I imagine Bolster will still be really good in draft. Uh, playing dragons will still be pretty good. Um, removal for dragons will be good. <laughs> I mean, I guess I'm just stating the obvious. Sunbringer's Torch. Touch. Alright, let's get back in the sauce here, huh? Iron Shaman. That is not sauce. I specifically requested the sauce, waiter. And you did not bring me the sauce. Uh, Thunderbeak Regent. That's alright. That's a good card. I'm trying to, like, not put my garbage in. My garbage is encroaching. Garbage. Garbage beans. Come on, let's find a Narset in here. Something. Kick it up a notch. Commune with Lava. I talked about before, I don't know about playing that Mono Red Burn. I don't know if anybody's talked about that. Maybe it's just too slow. 
I'm not a pro ex a pro modern player. But it feels like drawing cards. I mean, we saw how good Treasure Cruise was in Burn. Maybe it's just too late for that card. Den Protector. I don't know. We have a Foil Meringue, Meringue River Skeleton. And our rare is Ojitai's Command. Ojitai. Ojitai. Alright, six packs left. We need something here. Myth realized. I don't know if people really know what to think of a lot of these cards. I mean, the prices are kind of all over the place. There's a lot of like five and six dollar rares that I just think people are, they're waiting for. Ooh, there's a Narset emblem. Could it be? Same pack. Asher and Foremost. Very good card though. Don't give me, no, all right, listen to me, box. Don't be giving me that Narset emblem and then not giving me a Narset because that's just not cool, bro. Oh, Mythic, Risen Executioner. That art, though. Zombie tribal decks will we'll have fun with that. All right, four packs left. Again, thanks again to MTG Card Market. Their link is in the description below. All I ask is that you check them out. I'm not telling you you have to buy from them. Just saying, hey, check them out. And, uh... Make sure you check out how to win a booster box of Dragons of Turk here if you're watching this during the contest time and at least consider checking out the Game Fighter Kickstarter. The time to back is now. Um, we have to really build a lot of front end momentum and then I think that can carry us through. I'm hoping it can. Obscuring Aether. I don't know about that card. Somebody tell me why that card is good. Someone make a case for that card for me. What deck does it just go into that I don't know about? Salumgar's Command. Two packs left. Another Foil Rare. Whoa, Boltwing Marauder. That might be worth some bucks. Two Foil Rares in the box probably means I don't see another Planeswalker, but Hedonist Trove. A Foil Boltwing might be uh, a couple bucks. Not anything crazy, but um, it's actually very beautiful. And I may end up playing that card. Alright, here we go. Last pack. Mirror Mockery is our final rare. In case of nice, 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 noise, noise, noise. Noise, noise. Let us go through our box. <clears throat> Remember, if you enjoy watching product openings, make sure you subscribe so you get notified each and every time I upload a video. Mirror Mockery. Boltman Marauder, okay. I don't have all the prices memorized, so. Risen Executioner seems pretty good. Ashram Foremost. Again, um, Thunder Break Regent seems okay. Foil Sidisi Undead Vizier. Ojitai Exemplars and Sarkhan Unbroken were both good, all good pulls there. Bloodshin Fanatic, I think, is going to be good in standard. I think this card will probably still see play, although I don't know for sure. Pristine Skywise is good. Dragon Lord Jamoka is obviously good, but I don't know. You know, it's obviously really, really good. Um, uh, Avatar of the Resolute, too, is pretty good. Overall, pretty good box. I'll take it uh, every day of the weekend, twice on Sunday. Thanks for hanging out and watching this Just the Sauce video. If you missed any of my Dragons of Tarkir openings, it's all in a playlist, so make sure you come back and check them out. Thanks for watching this video, and we'll talk to you again real soon. Hope you enjoyed the video. And if you haven't already, check out some of our most popular playlists from MTG Vlogs, sick gameplay videos, new product breaks, and some insane vintage openings. I upload three to four new Magic the Gathering videos every week, so if you haven't already, please take a moment to crush that subscribe button to join one of the fastest growing Magic the Gathering channels on YouTube. Talk to you later.